Hey, 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 this is Kurt the Boat Doctor. At the house. I'm going to put in the little creek over there and go head out in the bay. <laughs> uh, minor little scrapes, 23 foot. Real nice boat, Luma Well Super V. It looked like it was a guide boat. I'll remember to check these here because I didn't turn on the lights for your dock lights. Got the anchor dairy. There's a bunch of stuff. I think a mortgage cover comes with this. Some uh, uh, pole holders come with it. Um, and I see the anchor lights there. The bow light, I'm sure, comes with it. It's in back. So there's life jackets and all that stuff it's in the back. I had to go get the depth finder and stuff like the Garmin and the keys and stuff. So. <clears throat> Anyway, spare tire, rogue channel trailer, way to go. Because it's channel, you don't have to worry about them rust from the inside out. And you got bunks that are made out of Tylex or the decking uh, up underneath. You got strakes, uh, two inch flat flip, those are good. Cables, those are good. Just make sure you check the casings if they're cracked, replace them. Flat five uh, brakes, I think they work, but I don't check that kind of stuff. Uh, amber light little dam that could be a ground five lug mag you got black and you got aluminum on the outside shine guides are good they had down riggers i don't know if that comes with it or not pop up cleats i like that because most of them are over there inside and it's a kind of a bummer every time you know to get your bombers and your rope you have to get in the boat or something to reach them uh and they didn't put them back here they put them up here that's kind of a nice deal uh like i say swivels looks like cannons there's your garmin uh for your reactor 40 probably and your gps and you got these are mounts for something uh, i don't know what and a crab david i don't know if that comes with it it probably does but he's got more of these sliders in the back he's got dual batteries in here uh you got the wash down hose this wash down or is, uh, Garmin's right there. There's ECUs underneath for the Garmin Autopilot. VHF there, the remote wireless. Got an F-250 uh, jet. Should push this just great. Looks like he's got forward scan, uh, as well as uh, maybe a 54 on the GT-54 on the transducer for the traditional sonar. Bucket looks good. Motor looks good. Uh, this you pull out and you grease this every time you use it. Just pump it up bearing grease. Uh, and then you can buy a flusher that goes in here. He may even have one with the boat. And then you pull that out, undo that, and then you screw in this flusher. And then it, you screw your garden hose into it and start the motor. Welded on uh, zinc. So total salt water protected on Yamaha. They don't plaster the salt water everywhere. It's a 2018 to 9.9 with a prop guard on the back trailer looks like in good shape got four seats even has cushions like i say i think he even got a motor cushion fuel gauge is full tank of gas and then the, one of those is the bilge is the far right and then the lights are right there i'll check them when i'm at the water you also got under up front lights too got a hand wash nine nine there's your autopilot those are Garmin. Those are really nice, by the way. Garmin's the only way to go. You know, I've worked with all of them. You know, there's good. The other one's good. Samrad's good. Lawrence is good. Um, you know, so on. Uh, anyway, the Garmin's pretty much. You know, you can get everything you talk. They got probably one of the best autopilots too. Uh, anyway, look at all the room. I mean, what a boat, huh? Okay. So anyway, we're gonna head on out. I'm gonna see what this bad boy will do. Boat doctor out. <laughs>